What's that? <gasps> Be careful! Air slash! Air oh. slash! Ha. Air slash! Ha. Air ha. slash! Ha. Air slash! Here we go! Oh. Ah. Air Unholy slash! Terror. Air slash! Unholy terror! Tractor beam! Air slash! That Don't overestimate your skills, you. Don't let up. Good luck, people. Power up! Dragon roar! Air slash! Explode! Focused, everyone! This isn't an even match! Air slash! Air slash! Power up! Ha! Air slash! Air I'm slash! Explode! Too much damage either. Got us flanked. Air slash. Yeah. Air yeah. slash. Galaxy Air Spirit slash. Galaxy Air Spirit slash. Rapid rain. Air slash. Air slash. Shadow flare. <laughs> We didn't there take too go. much damage either. <laughs> I'm glad for this. When did they? 
They've got us flanked. Air slash! Focused. Air slash. Air yeah. slash. <laughs> Galaxy Air slash. Air slash. Air slash. Tractor beam. Galaxy Air slash. Galaxy Spirit. We Guess don't have time over. to show pity for our enemies. Focused. Be careful, everyone! Air slash! Air slash! Power up! Air Holy slash! Explode! Don't let up. Good luck, people. Air slash. Hot. Air slash. Power up. Galaxy Star flare. No huh? victories. Nope. I hope you're watching, Father. Don't let up. Good luck, people. Air slash. Ha! Air slash. Ha! Power up. Air I'm slash. Whoa.
This could be trouble. Keep focused, everyone. This looks bad. I hope we can do this! More than over. guts to beat us. Fight! Something's been engraved on it. Oh, here, I can read this. Arrange the royal emblems of tradition on the land. Thy choice of arrangement shall reveal the key to opening the door. Now what could that mean? The royal emblems of tradition. They must be talking about these things, right? The emblems of the four kings? Right. Hmm. This must be the console we use to open the door. Let's try placing the emblems there. Please choose the correct emblem for each description. Show me the emblem passed down in the land of searing heat. Show me the emblem passed down in the land of the falling leaves. 
Show me the emblem passed down in the land of the frozen wastes. Show me the emblem passed down in the land of lush greenery. Confirmed. Successor access acknowledged. You may pass. It's open. How are the four emblems connected to the old race? We're certainly not going to find out just standing here. Let's go inside. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Um, maybe we'll find an explanation for this inside. of the Earth. But why is there a huge island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean? That definitely shouldn't be there. Or should it? If you believe the old stories, there really was an island there once. The Lost Continent of Mu. But even if that was true, what's a map of Earth doing in here? Pray that you have come seeking the Eye of Truth with only the purest of intentions. It is an extremely dangerous relic if left unguarded. We also pray that you have the strength to atone for the horrible mistake we made. The Eye of Truth is capable of opening gates to alternate dimensions. We created the Eye with a combination of our own technology and the symbology endowed upon us by the runes, the natives of this planet. But before we could reach our goal, there was a disaster that ruined all of our plans. A gate was opened to the demon world, sending legions of monsters pouring into this world. Even that, however, was not enough to halt our experimentation. Our small band of comrades was united under one wish. We only wanted to return home to our planet. So this is it. The Eye of Truth. What does all this mean, Elia? Everything's going way over my head. I think the people we call the Old Race came to this planet from Earth, from the Mu continent. I don't know about that. It doesn't seem like they came here so much, as they were brought here against their will. That's true. The King of Van told us that the Old Race descended upon the planet as fully grown adults. Legend has it that the Mu continent sank into the sea in the wake of a meteor strike. Before that day, the stories claimed that the Mua enjoyed a vast and highly advanced civilization. Yeah, I remember that. You know, the Alliance has a few reports on file about people being sucked into a vortex and suddenly reappearing someplace far away. There was a case of a missing child being found someplace that would have been physically impossible for him to travel to in the time he was gone. So, you think the meteor strike caused a vortex that swallowed these people up? Those reports you mentioned were about people going from one place to another on the same planet. I never saw any reports about people hopping light years, much less going from Earth to Roke. Oh, you got me there. But if that theory is correct, it would explain why they made something like the Eye of Truth in the first place. They just wanted to go home. That's what the guy said. And besides, it also matches the Mua's lore pretty well. The history handed down to the King of Mua. 
The eye was obtained in order to reveal the true path back to paradise. The eye failed to see the door to paradise, however. In its place, a door of blasphemy. Darkness swarmed forth, and demons enveloped the world. By the time the door was closed, the land was already near death. All we could do was lament our mistake. We must have deeply regretted what they had done. In their eyes, their desire to get home brought doom to this planet. They wanted to make up for it somehow, but by that time, there was no turning back. So they went to the royal families and left clues in the form of lore, so it could make it down to all generations to come. Well, we'll never know the whole story. But listening to the phrases they left behind about courage and everlasting strength, you can really feel the emotions they must have had in their hearts. The Eye of Truth. I knew you would be able to do it. Now it is time to storm the demon world. Yes, my lord. We are told that the gate to the demon world lies in a deserted island southwest of Silverland. I believe in you. Victory will be yours before long. Who are you? Glad to see you, Vermin, are doing well. Astral and Mu'az defenses are pathetic as usual. I was wondering what you little rats were scheming, but I suppose I had nothing to worry about after all. <laughs> You're too late. Too late. The great Asmodeus has already completed his new weapon. The only option all of you have left is complete, unconditional surrender. Like hell we do! We'll never surrender to the likes of you! <laughs> we'll see how long that bravado lasts. Remia! Remia, time to go inside. Yes, Mom. Look at that! What was that? <laughs> the fun's already begun. We figured you'd like a real-world example, so he's just destroyed a village! He what? You deranged murderers! You'll pay for this! Surrender at once! You have no choice! <laughs> Don't you run! Your Majesty, terrible news! Our guards report that the village of Durs has been destroyed in a gigantic explosion. They say there's absolutely no hope of survivors. How could this be? <laughs> Organize an immediate expedition force and set up rescue operations with Silverland soldiers. I don't care if there's no hope. We're not going to give up on them. Yes, sir. We must storm the demon world at once. If that weapon strikes Van or Astral, it would be an utter catastrophe. I'm afraid you're right. We haven't a moment to spare. This place must be closely connected with the demon world somehow. Ronix, it's time to open the door. Right. We're going in here? There's nothing to be scared of. We're here with you. 
Come on, show some guts. <sighs> You're right. We've got a world to save. Let's move. Usurp the body of my brother in arms. Your villainous behavior is nothing short of outrageous, and you will pay for it. And you believe you can do that with only one arm? Is that what you think, Ashley? You made it this far. Go ahead. Try to entertain me. This looks bad. This isn't an even match. Dragon Roar! Unholy Terror! Did it? Thank you for defeating him. The one who abused my name is gone. I have no regrets. Argosy, it's wonderful to see you again, Ashley. You still cared enough to call me your brother in arms, huh? Yes, the mirror of incarnation was behind it all. That was what created your shadow form. It was. The shadow was controlling my body. I cursed myself over and over, but I could do nothing. Hmm. I used to lose all memory whenever the shadow took over, but now the shadow and myself have changed places. So the shadow is gone now. You can make up for everything you did. No, not without the mirror of incarnation. And besides, I don't have long to live. I'm so sorry. Forget about it, Ashley. This was bound to happen the moment I was caught inside the mirror. But there is a more important matter at hand. Astral is in mortal danger. What? You must hurry. The Archfiend is after the bladeless sword I entrusted to Lias long ago. A bladeless sword? We can't afford to let his warning go to waste. Let's go back to the castle right now. Do you think we can make it back to Astral in time? Couldn't we use the Eye of Truth? It was made for opening holes in space, wasn't it? I suppose it's worth a shot. <laughs> that toy is a little too much for you children. Hand it over to me now, why don't you? What? Not if I can help it. If you dare to stand in the way of my king's orders, I will take all of you on at once. <laughs> Don't let up. I hope we can do this! Phoenix Blast! Blast! 
Looks like your luck's run right out. <sighs> what could that bladeless sword be? And why did the monsters want it so badly? The bladeless sword. One swing of it in the hands of Argosy was enough to dispatch the Archfiend during the war. One of the Crimson Shield's finest moments. We need to see Lias. The rest can wait until then. This is the sword that Argosy gave me during the Demonic Wars. The bladeless sword? He wasn't kidding. This is nothing but a hilt. Can I see it for a second? The beam sword. And a high-powered one at that. I've never seen anything like this. I was told it is an old race relic. He wielded it in the battle where we drove the Archfiend back into his world. This is it. Our ace in the hole against Asmodeus. Agreed. It's probably the one thing he fears the most. I'm sure it would be best in your hands, then. Don't relax quite yet, though. You may have the means, but you haven't won the battle yet. Thank you, sir. <laughs> 